Well, hello, combat crew! Would you like to win a Scorpion or Sub-Zero Mortal Kombat movie mask like this one? Well, all you need to do is be over 18 and follow Sinister Props and Bizarrely Funny on Instagram and like and comment on our giveaway posts, and you'll be automatically entered to win. The giveaway ends April 9th, so please don't be afraid to test your luck. Have a nice day! Well, well hello, hello combat crew. crew! Welcome to Scorpion and Sub-Zero! Sub Open a box! Today, I have another one by a sinister prop. I defeat. just want to say to any other sellers, we do have a lot of stuff that we've needed to unbox. This mask is actually from 919 of 2020. It is about six months old. That I, I had this mask just sitting here for all this time. Sinister, like I said, uh, in the previous, like maybe last week, I don't know if we just were back in the, putting these back to back like this, but like I said, Sinister has always been one to hear you out. Now, he wants to do new projects. He, he's a very, very passionate guy. And he asked, he's like, what Sub-Zero mask should I make next? And I pointed out this one. And I don't remember the name because I don't care. But uh, that should be what that is that you have is this custom mask from MK11. If you don't care, why are you buying them for me? Ah, well, I appreciate I it anyway. Know. But <laughs> let's just go ahead and open it. I know you'll cry if you don't have it. I don't want you to cry. Because <laughs> they'll freeze and they'll get all over the floor and they'll slip and fall on my knee. Well, I think it's just for all the birthdays you missed, right? Okay, well, let's open this up. Yeah, I missed a lot of birthdays. Let's open this up and let's see what we got here. Okay, so this has been long awaited. Six months we've been waiting on this one to see what we got in here. And here it is! Ta-da! Hey! It's almost, yeah, it it's is. like mythologies right there. This is like, uh, yeah. that's mythologies, or is that, um, what, is, is there another variation of the mythologies one afterwards in the PS2 era? I can't even remember if there's an alternate quite like this, but it's like, it's like the mythologies, but uh, mixed with the MK9 a little bit, you know? Whereas the uh, a little bit of shredder in there too, a little bit of shredder from uh, that's brilliant. Uh, Deadly Alliance. Oh my God, this has such a classic appeal. That's a nice blue too. That's a it's a dark blue, so it'll have to work with my darker outfits. But let's see, um, let's get some straps in this. I really like the placement of the vents. By the way, those are those are great. It's a really cool stylistic. I know that somebody's gonna tell me what game this is specifically from because it's clearly mythologies. But uh, maybe there is an alternate afterwards that's... Because I think the Mythologies one looks slightly different, but it might be too. I'm really yeah, confused. I like that classic appeal. But... Uh, the, the simplistic masks are, are, just have a special place in our hearts, you know? Because back when, in, in the MK3, it's just, a, it's just a face shell. That's it. There's no real bells and whistles or anything around it. About it. it looks like a piece of raised material that's padded. And you, this is kind of like that. It's kind of just got this, the shape, and it shapes your face. And it's a little bit battle worn as well. Perfect. You can see that going on too. I really do love this blue. And there's a pad on the inside for the nose, as usual. So let's go ahead and get some elastic in Good. here. Yep. Let's see. Okay, let me just go ahead. And yeah, there's a little screen mesh. I can see the images. I can't see very well. What you got. The math is usually, you know, you just kind of... There, but here are the images. You can see them while you're doing it. You kind of do like this. You go... All the angles here. Well, actually, this isn't probably a good idea. I should probably take this mask off first, which is also by Sinister, by the way, and put this up to my face. And now that it's up to my face, you can see how brilliant it looks, right? But uh, I'm going to do this with the elastic like we always do. I'm not strangling myself, seriously. Um, oh, come on. You don't want to die today? No, I, I, I don't. Today. I don't. So, no, no. No, it wouldn't. They would all miss you. So my method, I don't know if you guys, uh, have, if he has a scorpion. Scorpion is a different method, I think. But I just go based on when they touch. Because when they touch, you can just uh, stretch the elastic. You always want it to be a little bit flexible on you. As opposed to it being too loose. Yeah, you want to pull to your head. You don't want it to have its own weight. One strap for these. Yes, so all you do is holding them on our faces. You find that spot it's at the very the very these top edge. Right. If they're heavier or if you're doing any acrobatics or anything, you gotta have to. You have to. You have to have a support strap so it doesn't slip back over your head. My glue gun was off, so give me a moment for this to get hot. I don't like saying well, that. While you're while we're waiting for that. 
I'm gonna show you something. Just because. This right here. Don't fall. If you go to Amazon and uh, you look up Mortal Kombat lights, this shows up. Looks like this. I thought I was getting this as a light to hang on the wall. Nope. They gave me a steel plate. <laughs> Metal Mortal Kombat sign. I'm upset. Anyway, put that over there. Okay. Is it glued yet? What? No, I'm, I just only got one side on. I got distracted because you were showing something. Okay, I was just buying time here. Okay, okay, well, I'm almost done. We should use ice for this, you know? Yeah, you gotta heat it. We should just freeze it, it on. Really, really hot. Let it make it hot. You know? I got my glue gun over here. It's yellow. Your glue blue, isn't it? What? Yeah, it, it actually is. <laughs> it's blue. Yeah. He's got a blue glue gun! <laughs> I got a yellow glue gun. <laughs> oh, and I didn't even do that on purpose either. Blow on, Blow on it. Blow on it, Tundra. Been a while since somebody called me that. Somebody had to. So what do we think? Hey, yes, oh. okay. Oh, yeah, now I see it. Scar. Now That's I see really it. really working for your this? scar. Uh, <laughs> wow, how did you get that again? You never told me. What? How did I get the scar? Is that what you just asked? Yeah. I don't know, man. Do remember yet? No, I don't. And I'm feeling I awfully self-conscious about face. it. Okay, I'm going to put these on. Here, here look, I'm thing. not going to deal with this right? anymore. Is that a thing? I don't want to have to deal with people looking at my Whoa. scar. You can't see nothing now. No, I are can't. You sleeping goggles? <laughs> yes. Yes, they are. And you're so making cool. me wear them because I feel self-conscious about this. God. Okay. Oh, Stop looking at me. Oh. Now everybody's looking at me. Okay, no, I, they're looking at the no. mask, aren't they? You're looking at this beautiful mask. Wow, yes, I see it. I see the mythologies full on now. The way it fits my face. This is so classic. Oh my, I could not be happier with this. Um, I don't know. There's another um, with those classics. That unboxing probably hasn't happened, but I have another mythologies mask. So there's two very different mythologies masks. This one's more rounded and the other one's more boxy. Very kind of hard edges. And I really do love this appeal. I think even a little bit more because it fits a little bit more of my masks in general. Usually they're on a more rounded side and mythologies was just, it's very sharp. You could really cut somebody with that. You just hit them with your face and they'll just be bleeding yeah, all over the place. Your mask. So that's a lot of people don't understand that. You know, you gotta be able to attack with your mask too. That's why, that's why this one has spikes on it. Yeah, it's so great to be also, able to talk in these masks. By, uh, you guys can hear how clear I sound. I, yep, I'm actually recording on this too. Um, so yeah, I sound amazing, don't I? Testing, one, two, three. Testing, one, two, three. There's nothing in the way of you. There's no muffle, there's no nothing. I don't even know. Is this available on his shop? You guys should check it out because this I don't know if this oh, is one of those uh, ones where it's a listing everything he's made Everything he's done for us every new project he'll list it as something that he can do and so uh, It's right Yeah, it's right there $45 $45 Really? 45 Holy God. No straps. It'd be 55 if he put a strap in for you. Wow. But you don't have to do that if you don't want to. Okay, so you guys, if you Appreciate want a classic, it. if you want Mythology Sub-Zero, you know where to go. Sinister props. Wow. So what do you Sinister. have over here? What do I have? Are you going to unbox something? or? What do I have? Oh, sure. Let's do that. <laughs> oh, gosh. Look at that. Look at that spin around. Whoa. You got a Look spinny thing. What are those called? I got a spinny thing. <laughs> okay, so here we go. This is mine. I forgot to bring it until just now. But this is mine, and we don't normally do this, but we're gonna do this right now. Two makers in the same video. This one is the man, the myth, the legend. Another facecraft. Another facecraft right here. And he's gone right here. <laughs> Back there, right there. Uh, another facecraft released a mask recently on someone's request. I don't know if this is the same idea. This is the same thing, like it came from one of you. Noob, well, your brother, uh -huh. unboxed a mask from him, and I found out 
that it was a commenter, one of our fans, that commissioned him to make it. Really? So that's how Noob was able to get a hold of it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, wow. And this world, it's, it's very this small. This mask right here is mine, not Noob's. It's mine. And it's, uh, he actually put the name in. This is Harumi's Protector. Harumi's Protector from MK11. There's a plane. Another face patch actually put the mask name in it. Man, oh Not, my nobody's god. Nobody's doing that. I just at all. They just go here, Mortal Kombat Sub-Zero, Scorpion face, big helmet, mask, ninja, da 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 da. Tag 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 search ability, whatever. But he doesn't do it. He actually put what the mask is called. And props for that. Another face craft. And here it will be Harumi's protector. Mortal Kombat 11 in a yellow. It looks kind of like in the picture over there. It looks like a. It looks like Devorah's mask. <laughs> it looks like a Devora face, which doesn't make me uh, not happy, happy, right? Not at all. Not at all. Nope. I'm avoiding her. I am just so happy with this mask. I love the shape of it. You know, this looks like a old reptile as well, or even my MK11 mask that I wear in the uh, Christmas video. Mad, uh, Mad Santa too. It's like, this is like uh, the unevolved oh. version. But we'll stop talking about this mask and we'll, we'll start talking about what? This yellow one over here. Ugh, yellow. Yeah, the yellow one, the better one. No. All right, here we go. Uh, put this bubble wrap over here and look at this. Oh, yes. Okay, there's no forgetting anything in there. This mask maker is beyond a shadow of a doubt. Like a, a tent, right? All the time, all the time. For Ukraine, so, there are a lot of Ukrainian makers have a very unique style and I really like the way they do things. And he makes masks that are kind of, that are not like minimalist style, they're in between, they're not too big, they're about a medium. And so here, we go with this amazing mask. Look at oh, this. Oh, ho, ho. hey. Wow, that looks classic too. What is that, MK4 era or? No, this is, well, maybe. Maybe Variation. trying to do kind of like a recreation of that vibe. But this is MK11 exclusive. I know it. Oh, because it's the name, right? MK11 yeah. exclusive, trying to capture that kind of noob feel. But this is padded throughout. Boom, B-roll camera. Padded throughout, all over the jaw, across the cheek. The front would be ventilated with this pad right here. This is a pad, not solid. So it allows air to go directly out the front. There's a big shelf for the chin. I don't know what to think about that yet. Uh -huh. Big shelf for the chin, so that I won't have to have my belly clava up where I could go into my mouth eventually. Look at the size of that shelf. Very long. I'm wondering how close to that to my ear this is gonna get. Built-in strap mounts! Again! Hey! He's doing that now. I love Built that. Built-in strap I love mounts. that. Not glued at all. Really do. Solid. They'll yes. never come Four off. Four point harness. Unless the mask strap breaks. System. Weathered to perfection. Because perfect is not pretty. It is very ugly. Yeah. I love it. <laughs> it's got worn. Yeah. It's worn. It's It's got that metallic undertone to it. It looks like it was steel and then brush painted. Okay, we're gonna put this on. Here we go. Yeah. Okay. Let's see Ooh. it. Is he gonna look nice. uglier when he puts it on? Let's top one first. You know it, combat crew. We know it. it's it's happening. Whoa, hey! Oh you know that actually is working. It's got a very sharp edge up at the top oh, there in the back near the ears. Blue is not dry yet. But look at that fan! Yes! Hey! That's nice! <laughs> he never makes a mask that doesn't fit me. <laughs> it's touching touch, 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 all the way around, padded throughout. And it would be muffly if this didn't have this vent right in front of my mouth. 
It's so cool how it, it... I can hear my own voice though. It's traveling up the side into my head. The, uh, the mask ends right before the ear hole. Right before it. You know, your mask from so, the side. I don't have to... Yeah, so I don't have to worry about the mask covering my hearing. So I can put the headphones on and it goes right through. Nice! Into my hearing. For I can hear everything. These are solid. This is not mesh. Oh, so you can't padded. breathe through it. Built in. For Painted black. Can't breathe through that. Nope. But look at that. I can have a, I'm going to put my belly clavicle all the way down. All the way down. Under my chin now. You cannot tell. Yeah, you can't. You can't. Tell. You can't. That it goes belly all the way. That is not going in my mouth. How's your How's your nose? My nose? It's perfect. It's so weird well, how it, the, it from the there's side. There's a big, big pad. He does a very good job with the nose pad. And I don't know if we both have big noses or not. I'm pretty sure we might have the same nose because with the pad being here instead of plastic or uh, this is polyurethane. This polyurethane, he does a molding method. He sculpts this by hand. Makes a negative and then molds it. Then paints it. it. Takes forever. Then puts the straps in. He does the whole thing. This is sixty-five dollars. Hey, that's the really nice uh, yellow and black combo. And from the side, it actually looks a lot like my MK9 mask, the shape. But when you look at the front, it doesn't look as thick. It's like it's very boxy and bulky when you see it from a side profile. But front on, it does not have that appeal. It does. It looks much smaller when you look at it directly. Oh my gosh, the yellow is perfect. Yeah. <laughs> It looks very, very cool. I mean, uh, I, I don't like yellow, but I have I to wear. say that. I don't know if he chose this one because of me, but... But, uh, it, yeah. Yeah, this is great. Really it's a five. happy with my mask. Always, I don't know... Five out of five flaming skulls. I have to do the same. Five out of five flaming skulls. I have to do not to flaming skulls, though. So I'm giving this five out of five as well on the snow cones or the popsicles. Let's do popsicles this time, because... I really think this mask is comfortable, breathable, as always, stilt shop, uh, stilt shop, sorry, sinister props, not stilt shop. Sinister props used to be stilt shop, but now sinister props. Yes, he has all these sinister. air holes. You can hear me very clearly. Um, I did have to put a strap in because you have to pay a little bit more for that. The mask, they always fit me. They always fit me great. So if you have a face that's the same size as mine, you're gonna do really well with this guy. And as you can see, it's got a really good shape to it from the side, from the front. Oh, it's just such a good classic appeal. A good uh, blue as well. Underneath you have a black, so you have a little bit of that battle-worn effect that, that um, Sinister always does that. It feels like he always kind of has a little bit of yeah, a battle-worn thing going on. I love and that. And it's only $45. Oh yeah, the $45 thing's the most important thing. This is cheap as hell. For this, if you want to go classic, so. And this is 65, so it's 20 dollars more. So that's gonna give you an idea. Look what these makers are up against. You know, cost versus labor, time, materials, stuff like that. Their mask gets up there in the hundreds and stuff like for some of these other sellers. I think that's a lot of pride. And another factor. Like not very. Sorry, another factor to the difference in the prices is, is the Scorpion stuff is in sadly higher demand, so people can charge a little bit more for that. Your, your mask was first. <laughs> you're gonna these first. I'm going to point, point your eye. Yeah, you're probably right, though. You're right. I, yeah, you, if you, you look for Especially, my mask, you don't find nearly as many as, as him. It's sad. It's another facecraft hasn't really done an official Sub-Zero design. Please, another facecraft. Give me some love. Please. Oh, yeah, don't, don't mean to put pressure on you. Sub Zero, some love across the table, huh? Yeah. I... Get get one of his masks. On Wait, uh, uh, com, com, uh, combat crew. Which guy? Which mask? <laughs> combat crew. Yes. Which mask do you think that uh, another facecraft or these sellers should make that you haven't seen me wear yet? Let us know in the comments below, please. And what else do you have to and say? And so he will know if he watches this. And like, comment, and subscribe for more, whatever the heck it is we're gonna do. After you click the bell. Yeah, click that bell, please. Make things, whatever Since I'm back, be. I missed you guys. Love you. Have a nice day, my frosty friends.